Yet another display for Univary datasets is a box plot, or sometimes called a box and whisker plot. And it's based on the five number summary. So if you take a data set and find the median, in this case there are an even number of data sets, so the median or the 50th percentile is 82, that's the middle number of the five number summary. So down below we have now a box and whisker plot and the middle bar, vertical bar of the box is the median. If you take essentially the median of the lower half of data values, in this case you get 77, and that's called in statistics Q1, Q sub 1, just called Q1, or the 25th percentile. And in this case, Q1 is 77. That's at the left end of the box of the box and whisker plot. The median of the upper half is called Q3. It's written Q sub 3, but we call it Q3, or the 75th percentile. In this case, that's 84, and that's the right boundary of the box. And then if you add to that the minimum and the maximum, the minimum is 70, and that goes at the left end of the whisker, and the maximum is 100, and that goes at the right end of the whisker. And here you have then the box and whisker plot. 25% of the data is here. 25% of the data is here, 25% of the data is here, and 25% of the data is here. So some of the characteristics of a box and whisker plot, the individual data values are not shown, but finally now the five number summary is shown directly on display, not the mean or the standard deviation. It's great for large data sets, and it's not good for small data sets. I would use as a rule of thumb that you need about 20 at least 20 data values in order to be able to appropriately use the box and whisker plot. That's just a rule of thumb. And the important characteristic is that it shows the five number summary. And that's an introduction to box plots and the five number summary.